Deputy yeah, and I want to join with other deputies uh, in calling for the details of the large scale uh, sports capital grants to be made available and to allow projects to make applications. Um, you will know, Minister, that, uh, as I've spoken to you many times about it, Bohemians Football Club and Daniel Stadium, a stadium with huge history, um, but also huge potential, uh, and the partnership between the FAI, Dublin City Council and Bowes um, has the opportunity to apply for, for uh, such a scheme, uh, and I believe will have huge benefit both in the community, because it's not just uh, about the club itself, uh, it's also about the work that they do on and off the pitch. Uh, and I think the partnership with Dublin City Council, uh, with the Fisborough area, which I, I don't represent, uh, but I know many of the groups there, uh, and also the wider uh, community on the north side. Uh, and I know these large-scale projects, I suppose, fall outside of the normal run of uh, sports capital grants, but they're incredibly important, and I think they have a huge impact uh, on the cultural and sporting life uh, of an area. But I don't have to explain that to either yourself or Minister Martin. Deputy. I know these are huge supporters. In relation to, to Dalymount, um, uh, Dalymount Park, a place I know well. My, my late father played there um, uh, against uh, Bohemians and probably others at the time. Um, so that is a project, that, again, that I visited too with, with Centre Fitzpatrick as well, and it's one that has received funding to go to planning. The, the, the LSSAF funding has allowed that to go into planning, and they're obviously waiting to submit an application uh, for LSSAF funding.